Another quick tip video, this time about how you can spread polyphonic voices with the Bog Audio mixers. Here I have chords coming from the note sequencer um, from JW, four note chords, sequencing Opolus. Right, and now I have a few options. I can either sum this polyphonic voice, right, and just with the sum module from VCV and just have all of the four voices together. Right, or I can spread them if I want to have more control. I can split them and then send them to some sort of mixer. Right, and then have more control. But the Bog Audio mixers have this built in. Right, so if I send the polyphonic signal to the first input of the mixer, let me zoom in a bit. Right, in the right click menu. I can choose input one poly spread and I can choose one to four because I have four uh, 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 channels of polyphony. One to four. And now this polyphonic signal is spread. You can see I have one, two, three, and four notes if I mute them, right? One note. Right, so I have now the mixer spread the polyphonic signal through its inputs and now the possibilities are basically endless. Right, because now for example I can pan the voices left and right, I can also add panning modulation, I have here an LFO, so let's say I want to add modulation to the fourth voice, right, if I solo it. Right, so this is just the one voice from the polyphonic signal. I can also add rhythmic variation. Right, I have here uh, the eight-step sequencer from Count Modula, um, basically gating an ADSR, modulating decay and release. And now I can use this to modulate the level of the first voice, for example. Right. So again, we have panning modulation, we pan two voices, and we have also rhythmic variation. The mixers from Bog Audio have also send and return. There is an expander that you can just connect to the right of the mixer. Right, and now here we have send and return. Let me move the LFO here. Right, so I have send and return set with Chronoblob 2 and Debriatus, so delay and a bit of crunch with saturation. And now I can send each one of these voices with different amounts to the delay, again adding send and return to the different channels of the polyphonic voice. So let's say I want the first voice, let me solo it. Right, I can also uh, change the EQ, low, mid and high for each of the channels. Right, let's unmute this. a bit. Right, and again send each of them to different effects if you want. Right, so like this you can spread the polyphonic voices, have more control over each of the voice. And um, if you are not so sure about polyphony in VCV, I will put a link in the description to a video I made all about polyphony in VCV too. I just want to mention that if you have more than four voices of polyphony, so here for example I have 10 voices, 10 channels of polyphony, you can use and chain uh, mixers, right? So here, for example, I have the eight channel mixer in the right click menu, I can choose one to eight. So I have one to eight uh, channels of polyphony and then send the copy of this to another mixer and then choose nine to 12. And then I will have one to eight here and then the nine and ten here right so i have ten channels of polyphony you see here we have eight here we have two so this will work also if you have more channels of polyphony and you can spread and have more control over the different polyphonic voices